Hi friends, good morning. Please look at the next problem. See A, B, C. A, B, C can separately work. Can separately work in 24 days, 36 days and 48 days respectively. They started work together. They started working together. And C left after 4 days of start. That means C worked for only 4 days. After 4 days, C left the work. Then coming to A, A left 3 days before completion of the work. And B remains in the work from beginning to end. In how many days the work was completed? See friends, let us say the total work, the total work, LCM of these 3, total work, total work, is equal to 144 units that is the LCM of these three numbers. Now the total work is 144 units. A can complete this 144 units of work in 24 days. That means A can do that means A can do 24 sixes 144. A can do 6 units of work whereas B B 36, B can complete this work in 36 days. That means 36 force, 36 force 144. So 144 by 36. So B can do, B can do 4 units of work per day. Whereas C, 43 is 144. So C can complete this work in 48 days. So C can do 3 units of work per day. 3 units of work per day. Now, now let us say assume the total work lasted for uh, X days. The total work lasted for X days. Let us see how, who worked for how many days. C worked for 4 days. That is C left 4 days after the start of the work. So C worked for three days, 4 days. So in 4 days C completes 4 threes, 12 units of work. B was it B has been in the work from beginning to end. So C worked for all the 6 days, all the X days. That is 4 X days. A left 3 days before the completion of the work. So A was in the work only for X minus 3 days. So in X minus 3 days, how many units of work will A complete? So A do 6 into X minus 3 units. B 4 X units plus C 12 units. And the total work must be equal to your 144 units, 6x plus 4x, 12x, 10x, minus 18 plus 12, minus 6 is equal to 144, 10x is equal to 150, x is equal to 15 days. So, your answer is 15 days. The work lasted for 15 days.